So if you didn't know, Nintendo dropped a new update on the 3DS and basically if your console was modded and you update it without doing some things beforehand, you're essentially going to get a brick console, your 3DS is not going to work properly with all the mods, and it's just going to be an issue. And me being me, I knew there was a way that I could fix it, so I went ahead and made a tutorial on TikTok. The video was doing good, the first hour had like 30 something thousand views, and I, I knew it was going to go up, and... Nintendo took it down. They gave me a guideline strike on TikTok. They didn't do it on YouTube, which I'm not going to show you how to do it in this video, but just know I made a short on it, so make sure you check out the short. I'm not going to leave it in the description because I can't take no risks. Nintendo's not happy with your boy, but if you check out my channel, I did make a short on how to prevent your modded 3DS from getting bricked. But yeah, I find this really interesting because obviously, you know, Nintendo took me down. That's their prerogative. You know, it's Nintendo being Nintendo, but I feel like this is a little greedy. It would be different if I was making videos on how to mod a Nintendo Switch. Then I don't even, I'm not even mad if they did something like that, but I don't do that. This is a console that came out 12 years ago, Nintendo. 12 years ago. Not only is it 12 years old, you don't even support it no more. You took the, the shop down so people can't even buy new games. You haven't released a new title for the 3DS in a, a few years at this point. But now you want to make an update? You want to put in the effort to make an update to mod or to brick modded consoles? That doesn't really add up to me. You're not supporting it at all. But you're putting the effort and time to make an update to brick modded consoles. That, that's a, just a little weird to me. Hopefully y'all didn't just turn your 3DS on like a normal day and go ahead and update your console naturally because if you did, I feel bad for you. I'm not going to lie to you. But hopefully some of y'all caught my video from yesterday, my little short. I think it's at like 5k views or something like that. But yeah, if you want to know how to prevent your console from getting bricked, make sure you check out my short from yesterday. But let me know how you feel about this whole situation. I think it's kind of... I think it's kind of disgusting, to be honest. A 12-year-old console that they don't support anymore. They put in the effort to make a, a new update to break people's modded consoles. It's kind of weird to me. But, like I said, let me know in the comments how you feel about this. And hopefully, 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 none of y'all updated it before doing these repercussions. Or repercussion? I don't even know if I'm saying the word right. But yeah, y'all get the point. Make sure you check out my last video. I made a video talking about and remembering Ultimate Spider-Man. What a banger of a game. But yeah, man, hopefully they didn't get you. I'll see y'all next time.